Hello everyone, today I want to share with you a pretty quick trick of how to format banded row manually. So let's say this is um, a table that I want to format to a banded row, like with different colors um, alternatively. Um, the most natural way to do it is of course selecting the whole data and um, table and then go to maybe like um, uh, a banded table like this. Right. Uh, so this is the most easy method. But what I don't like sometimes is that there's some restrictions when you format a data uh, table. So, for example, one thing I don't like is, uh, say, when you insert uh, a tape, like um, when you insert a column, you can't really get rid of the title, even if you want to leave as blank. So this is when I was always thinking, okay, if I can do it manually, um, that will be great. And I'm going to show you two ways to do it. The first way to do it um, is actually pretty easy. After you format as table now, let's say you don't like it, you just go to the table tool on the top and then go convert to range. Yes. And then it's going to be a range. It's not going to be a table anymore. And then now here you can actually delete um, the title and the column as you wish. And everything is exactly uh, like what you can do before. Um, so that's the first method. Another method to do it um, is using conditional formatting. So let me um, change it to the original table that we want. So let's say this is the original table. And then I want to have this range to be with banded row. So now what I do is I go to conditional formatting and I go to new rules. And then I go to use a formula to determine which cell to format. And then I type in my formula here, which is uh, what I show on the screen there. It's mode row comma two uh, two equal zero. So I'm saying that when this formula is true, I want to format my columns to be, let's say, a gray, uh, maybe a, like a deeper gray. Yeah, sure. And then I want the field to be a gray color and then OK it. And then OK it. Uh, it's not working here because I think I have, yeah, so I think I had the wrong comma here. So now it's filled and then it's okay. Yeah, so you see this is actually how you have the banded row like automatically. And actually, if you want to make change to say different color, you just go back to conditional formatting, manage rules uh, here, select it, added rules. And then just go format and then say if I want to use orange, um, orange ish, yellowish, and then you go OK, apply, OK, and here we go. So this is a pretty quick trick, and I hope that it's been helpful to you. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you like it. If you have any question, please leave me a comment, and I will talk to you very soon.